Ron says their reputation is being damaged after a mistake was made by the Douglas County Health Department. Our Marlo Lundak explains the miscommunication and shares the owner's frustration. Southern Spoon owner Jay Overton prides himself on his restaurant's delicious by the pound food. You know, we got your fried chicken, your actual, you know, your catfish, your pork chops. He's also proud of his consistent health inspection ratings. He says it's never dropped below excellent, the second highest score on the health department's website. But now, his restaurant is facing the threat of closure due to past due payments for food and drink permits. We did everything we were supposed to do to actually go ahead and actually circumvent this from happening so we don't get on this list. He says the health department came for their biannual inspection on the 16th. Like, do I owe you a check? It was one of the things that we actually asked the inspector, like, hey, do I owe you any kind of actually monetary, you know, return for coming out here today and making sure that we're good? And he emphatically told me after asking three different times, no, you don't owe us anything. But fast forward to Tuesday. The health department released a list of restaurants with expired permits and Southern Spoon was on it. It makes us look bad as business owners. Like I said, it's kind of shaming the actual restaurant owner and that's not good. Like I said, we're getting phone calls, we're getting texts, we're getting messages on social media. Here, are you guys still open? We're heard they're shutting you down. The health department told Six News the inspector made a quote, honest mistake by telling Overton his payments were up to date when they weren't. But they never called Overton to explain that they made the mistake. The public she's shaming the business to actually cause them issues and problems is not the way to handle it. The health department told Overton to make up for it, they would waive $100 of his late fees. But Overton says the damage is already done. That oversight is worth more than $100 to us because you, like we actually discussed, it's like the customers look at it from perspective of well, health department, restaurant, I'm not going there. On your side in Omaha, Marlo Lundak, 6 News. Overton tells 6 News the past due permits will be paid first thing in the morning. When asked about the miscommunication that Overton says damaged his restaurant's reputation, the health department said in a statement, quote, we apologize for any confusion that may have taken place.